I think the need for social entrepreneurship has never been greater in India than now. I'm going to illustrate with a small example. Let's assume I am a non-profit organization and I find that there's a need for 40,000 children to be administered the polio vaccine in a particular village. I don't have the money, nor do I have the reach. I go to the uh, district collector and I say, look, I believe that 40,000 children here require the polio vaccine. Can you, with your resources, get those 40,000 children into your schools within an area of maybe two, 300 meters where I can administer the vaccines? And the government says, yes, of course we can. He sends news out to his block development officers. And the next thing you know is, within the space of a week, 40,000 children are brought in for their vaccines. That still doesn't solve the problem of the actual vaccine. And that's where I approach corporate India. And I ask corporate India for the money to buy the vaccines. So here you have what I believe is potentially the most powerful triangle in India's progress. It's corporate India, NGO India, and government India getting together to do something because if each of them were on their own, they could not administer those 40,000 polio vaccines without the other. So the great thing about IDEA is that if you have an idea that uh, you think uh, deserves funding, deserves um, uh, an expansion, deserves uh, converting it from a dream into reality, you can actually meet with the right people here. And if they believe in your idea, then uh, this is the first place where you can uh, give it shape and, and give it legs to move. So if you have a dream to make a difference, be a part of IDEA, the National Social Venture Competition, presented by the Indian School of Business.